about what your math time should look like and sound like. I'll give you about 30 seconds to share with somebody close to you what that time Can should look that? like and sound like. Go. Really Miliana, why don't you scoot up close so you have a buddy to chat with? show me two. If you have three ideas, show me three. <coughs> if you have four ideas, show me four. That's so many. If you are still thinking, take your hand and put it in a fist. Put it right here so that I know and you know that you're thinking about what math looks like and sounds like. Mrs. Ruder, are you ready to collect some ideas? your expectations, what you want your math time to look and sound like. Emiliano, you have your finger up with one. You have a one good idea? I can't hear you. You forgot. Okay. Who else? Mario, you have your finger up. One um, good idea. What do you want your math zone time to look and sound like? Um, that you get to be in a race car and to start your engine, you have to do math. Oh, you could. We could think of yourselves like a race car, and we need to do math to do things in our lives. What do you want it to look like in our classroom when we're working together and when you're working by yourself? Think about when we came up with a list for Read to Self. We came up with some things that we wanted to see and look like. What do you want your math time to be like? Ooh, Mrs. Oh. Gilbert. I'm going to ask you, do you think quiet voices would be helpful? I think so, because if I'm doing my work and it's noisy, I can't focus. Mm -hmm. It's really, and I know in math we really have to struggle and think and try, mm -hmm. so I think quiet voices would be really helpful. Oh. I like that one. How many of you work better when it's quiet in here and your brain can think? Yeah. A lot of people work better that way because when there's too much going on, your brain tries to do everything and it can't do everything. Okay? Not at least very well. Jaylin, what do you want your math zone time to look like? Or sound? To sound one voice or a zero voice. Oh, so you're talking about our voice expectation level? So you're saying it should be either a zero or a one whisper? How many of you think that'd be a good idea? Thumb up if you think that'd be a good idea. Ooh, I see a lot of thumbs up, and I even see some me twos. They agree with you. So maybe behind this, we can put a zero or a one voice level, which is a great reminder to go to the chart if you need to think back. Good job. All right. Anybody else have some? Because we have a really good one. This is very important, but I'm wondering if there's more, especially when we made our read to self list. I erased it just before you started math. But there was a lot of things. What else is important when you're doing math in this classroom? Yeah. Check Ooh. for understanding. Mm, I like it. Mm. Should we add it to our list? It's just like when you're reading. 
you want it to make sense. When you do math, you want to make sure that your work and your solutions make sense. Mm, that's a really good one. Because if I'm just doing work just to put something on the paper and I don't get it, am I growing my brain? Am I growing my brain? No, we just talked about that last week. We want our brains to grow out of our ears. So what are you doing? This would be starting it. Does what you're working on make sense to you? Can you show that to your friends, to your teachers? Oh, Mrs. Gilbert, have you ever seen such a great class come up with such good ideas? I have not. And I have done this now three or four times in different classrooms. And you guys, you have some fantastic ideas. I can't wait to hear what else you're thinking about. Oh, Mary Cruz, what are you thinking about? <gasps> That's one of my favorites. Say it again for your classmates. What do you think she just said, Sam? Can you fix that so you can listen? Okay. Maybe it would help if you moved away from your friends. Do you remember sometimes that helps us a little bit? Say it again so that Sam and Edgar can listen. Work the whole time. What if I'm really tired and it's Monday and I just want to take a break? Is math time a good time for breaks? Okay. No. Why? We have break time. But we also have work time. So we need to work the whole time to get more breaks. <laughs> Is that how it works? Yes. No. Yes. Okay. And we're going to be practicing this because we're going to be building our stamina. Yeah. Okay. So working the whole time is very important, especially when we're working on centers. Because okay? that's how you your brains start to grow out of your ears. Miss what if, wait, 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 Mrs. Gilbert. Yeah. A lot of times when I work with Mrs. Gilbert, you know what happens? She's she knows too. Do you know what happens? She goes, Mrs. Ru I just don't feel like doing this right now. I think I'm done. Yeah. I'm just gonna put my head down for a little while because I worked really hard. It's hot in here. And I had a really busy weekend, and I just am not interested in math today, so. Is that okay? No. It is? No. 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 And you know what? It kind of bugs me because sometimes I need her because she might be my partner. And she likes to talk you about. You can just do it, Mrs. Ruth. Yeah, and she goes, Mrs. Ruth, just do it. And I said, I don't want to do it by myself. We're a team. We're working together. I guess she find another partner. Yeah, but what if she's my only partner? And you know what, Mrs. Root, when I put my head down like this, you know what I can feel my brain doing? It was doing like this game. Oh no. That's not what I want for my brain at all. I'm worried about you. All right. Well, now that you know you have to work the whole time, Mrs. Gilbert, are you going to be able to do it? Um, well, I really want my brain to grow, so I guess, okay, I'm ready. I'm ready. ready to work. And here's the good news. We should tell Mrs. Gilbert what comes after math time. Math. 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 Wait. 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 Right after math, we get lunch to fill our brains and our bodies back up with good energy. Exactly. exactly. So we have quiet voices. We have check for understanding. Does it make sense? We have work the whole time. Who just said something that started with an S? I heard it. What was it? What about strategies? Oh, can you explain to your friends what using strategies means? You know, can someone
somebody help her? Pick a friend with their hand up to help you. Oh, you're so close. All right, Cruz, pick a friend with their hand up. If you know what it means, I've got to use this strategy. What? How can you help, Mari Cruz? Who'd you pick? Mario. A bar graph would be a math tool, yes. But what does it mean? Your second grade teachers didn't teach you any strategies? No. Yes. What's a strategy? Help. They're kind of like tricks, aren't they? Or they're rules to help you become better at math, okay? So use your strategies. Mrs. Root, what? What are you holding up? Oh, well, this says resource journal, resource. And I know that a resource is something that I can use when I get stuck. And I think, Mrs. Root, are, are we going to give them some resources for this? I was just going to tell you, oh, we're going to pack all kinds of cool things in that resource journal. All fun things, like charts and rules and things like that, that when you have a problem, instead of coming to Mrs. Gilbert or myself, because guess what? We might not be able to help you because we might be working with other students who need help. You can go to your resource journal and get help or look for strategies and get better at math. It's a win-win. What else do you want your math time to look like? What else do you want your math time to look like? Oh, Jen, what do you think? You want it to be fun? For sure, it can be fun when we do all these things together. I like that. Would it be fun if everyone used their normal or presentation voice? No. No. Would it be fun if some people were working and some people were playing? No. No. So we need to follow these expectations in order for that to happen. What's another thing you want your math time to look like? Because you're going to have a lot of free choice. You're going to have a lot of time where you're responsible for your brain's growth. What else do you want to look like? So you're working the whole time? I like that. And you're not wasting time. Mm-hmm. So you don't want to see lazy people? No laziness. No laziness. Mr. Check out my huge tower. It's so big. It's gonna break. Oh. Isn't it great? Look, it can be like a little lightsaber too. You're being you, lazy. You. Um, <laughs> That's not is it cool? I'm confused, cool. Mrs. Gilbert. I thought we were doing math right now. We well, got yeah, it's math. See, one, two, three, four, five, six. I can just count them. That's math. <laughs> what? How many yeah. of you think, Mrs. Gilbert? And look, if I break one off, then I'm doing takeaway. That's math. Ten, ten, take away ten. I'm sorry. Excuse me a minute, Mrs. Gilbert. This is math time. This is not play time. But these are so fun. No, those are not. Those are not toys, they're tools. But it is. But it she's taken like away. Toy. I'm sorry, you guys. I thought she knew we were doing math right it now. It is math. She's taken take away. Take yes, she's taken away. Mine is so it equals a number. But I can't just build a really cool, fun tower and then pretend it's a lightsaber? No. 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 It's not a tool. It's what do I need to use, use these tools for? Playtime. Yeah, the tools. Tools. Yeah, and build stamina. Not tools. 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 Not tools.
noise. And it's true. Also, build your stamina. Friends, pretend you did not see that because when you are allowed, I'll wait till I have eyes and ears back on you a minute. I know, she totally got you distracted. Sometimes she does that. Mrs. Drew, I put my things away. I put them away. They're all cleaned up. They're nice and neat. No, no, no. No, no, no. I can see the red Mrs. thing. Mrs. Gilbert, we practiced this yesterday. You did? Yeah. Uh, it's not what we practice. Because my even my third graders know that when you get something out, you put it back the Wait. Same, way you found it. same way you found it. Edgar, can, can you handle sitting here or do you need to go to your seat? That's what I thought. So these cubes should go here? No. Because no. I like things nice and tall. Is that the cube bin? No. No. All right. So when you use the tools yeah, for math, that's where it was. you need to return your supplies the same way you found them. Correct? Yeah. All right. Why, Mrs. Rue? That's no fun. I just like to leave a mess. It's easy. Yes, it is. <laughs> that's not easy. It's dirty. No, it's very easy. No, it's, it's not easy. easy. Yeah, but then your house is going to be a mess. It would be a mess. Yeah, what about easy. other students that want to use those tools? Would they be able to do that? They don't know no. they are, so they don't they wouldn't be, So that's not fair to the other students. I think you're right. All right, so we have a really nice list. And Mrs. Gilbert, I think you should put your eyes on it a minute. Okay. I'm going to wait for all my friends to put their eyes on it, too. Emiliano, are you ready? All right, read it with me. Quiet voices. Check for understanding. Does it make sense? Work the whole time. Build your stamina. Use strategies for your resource journal. No laziness. Use the tools, not toys. Return supplies the same way you found them. There's one more that I have floating in my head, and it's a really good one. Because you know what? When I can't do something to get mad sometimes, and I say, I don't want to do this anymore. Miss Ruth, I can't, can't do it anymore. It. It's too I can't hard. Do it. It's too hard. Uh oh, Mrs. Rue, yeah? when you do that, what happens to your brain? It gets too red. Your face is red. Yeah, because I was mad. Well, math makes me mad sometimes, Mrs. Gilbert, because it's so hard. Do you want to know something? Math is supposed to be hard. Why? It's supposed to be, because if it's not, then your brain never grows. So you're saying that even if math is hard, that I need to keep trying. trying, even if it's hard? Yes, because after a while, if you keep trying, your brain, gets bigger your brain will bigger. grow and then it won't be so hard. Emiliano, are you ready to sit down with us and listen? Then I need to see that at least. All right. Wow, we are rocking out this list right now. This is good. Did your other classes come up with a list this good? Not that good. Because not only when we do all these things is math going to be fun, but our brains are going to grow. Yes. We're going to be ready for fourth grade. All kinds of good things can happen. You guys are going to be amazing mathematicians. Mm -hmm. All third grade. I will be here not every day, but a couple days a week. I'll get to be here and do math with you guys. I'm really excited knowing that. <coughs> Excuse me. Our math time is going to look like this because we can get so much fun stuff done. I am so
super excited. Mm -hmm. I'm super excited to see how you guys struggle and try and work hard. Really cool. Great job. Can you take your right hand and pat yourself on the back? Is that awesome? I have a question. I would love to leave this up all the time, but we need to erase the board eventually. How can I remember these things? So when we start our math zones, everybody has a place to look to see their way to be. Oh, I'm hearing, I'm hearing a really, really, oh, oh look, she's getting excited. She's getting excited. Guess what's on your desk right now? Research journal. Research journal. And you know what's really funny is you guys came up with the same things that I typed out before. You were like re reading read my mind. mind. Amazing. So here's the even better part of today. Can you find a good place for that? Thank you. The better part of today is that you do not even have to write these down. You have to cut this out and glue it inside your... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.